Conceive, believe, achieve. This is former UFC middleweight champion of the world, Michael Bisping. Paddy the Baddy here. You're listening to Combat Sports UK. And you're watching Combat Sports UK. Alright, so four nations gold medalist. Just how good does that sound? Amazing, man. Feels incredible. Well, that's, that's all I've been able to say, man. It feels so good. I mean, that's about three fights over three days, and it's not just about how difficult that might be. Yeah. It's the caliber of fighters you've actually gone in there against. Yeah. Jay Aspen Moore is a two time amateur champ. Kane Darcy, who you avenged the loss to, and now today. Just how good does it feel, and how much confidence does that give you going forward? It feels incredible. My confidence has boosted so much. I feel like I'm the man. I'm the talk of the guy here, talk of the town. So, uh, it feels incredible. I've had the hardest route to get gold. I fought the best guys, so it just feels incredible. Yeah. Coming in, you actually had lost to King Darcy a few months ago. Does it feel that much bit sweet to be coming in here at Four Nations? Got a gold medal and got that victory over him. See, that was the one fight I was looking forward to. I was like, hope I get Kane there. Just because he beat me and I know, I know I'm so much better than him. He's a great fighter, like, but I feel like I'm the man right now. No one's as good as me in amateur. I've done it. I'm the best. I'm, I'm the number one in the UK, I feel. Relatively and lightweight, so I've done my bit. How did it feel actually having three fights over three days? Because that's obviously a fast schedule for someone. It's quite tough, it's quite tough. So the, the first fight obviously you've got the same nerves and that and then the next day you know what you're coming into. So it's like, it's not as bad, but you still know you're going into a fight. Uh, the experience is incredible, honestly. I'd recommend it to anyone to come an amateur, as I said before. Anyone looking to get experience, coming to like four nation competitions like this, it's, it's an incredible opportunity. So. Normally, at an amateur show, you're representing yourself, you're representing your team. Mm. But four nations, you're not just representing yourself, you're not just representing your team. But you're also representing Scotland. Right. Just how good does it feel to come down here with all the Scottish guys and take gold home? It feels incredible, honestly. Still out for my country, my teammates, my family. I'm so emotional. I feel, I feel incredible, amazing. So, it feels great, man. I'm and Scottish, are good fighters. Mm-hmm. Got a lot of heart. You need to change the game, put us on the map. You know, people need to know. That's the gold medal for nations. What does the rest of 2023 look like for you? So that's my last amateur contest. I'm looking to go pro now, so take, take over the pro scene, change the game. Just train hard with all my teammates. We've all got massive goals, massive dreams. And I'm aiming for the stars, you know what I mean? I'm going all the way to the top. I want to be more than a UFC champion. I want to be the best, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Where can we expect to see you for your professional debut? Have you got anywhere in mind? No one in mind just now, man. Just I'll well, get back in the tr- gym and train hard and see what opportunities arise. I know this has put my name up out there, so. Like something big. Yeah. Lovely. Congratulations, Lorenzo. Gold medalist at Four Nations. Congratulations. Thank you. Very much.